Hello golfers and welcome to the Jess Frank Golf Academy YouTube channel here at the beautiful Deer Creek Golf Club. Drop 30 shots in 30 seconds with this easy backswing fix. Okay, so what we're gonna do here, most golfers that come to me, they're taking their backswing too far in. They're taking it too far up. So how do you know your backswing? So your backswing's really simple here. Simple formula, hands in, club head out, so that way you have a system to take the club back. So as I take the club back, my hands are traveling in off an arc, club head staying out, and going up to the top of your swing. Comes back down, hands in, club head out, all the way around to my front side. So if you do that little drill, and you saw how slow I did that. That was even under 30 seconds. That's gonna help you shoot lower scores for sure. So here we go. So again, hands in, club head out. Very simple drill. So what this does is that most people either lift their arms too much, pull their hands too far. So what we're gonna do, again, super slow motion. So it's a combination here, hands in, club head out. You can see how the club head's going up. It's making an arc around my body. From here, club head's coming down, hands coming down, hitting the back of the ball, tracing the arc forward. And so not only do I have my hands in, club head out on the back swing, but on the forward swing, tracing the arc around my body, my hands also go in, club head out. So I would say if you trace the arc, hands in, club head out on the back swing, hands in, club head out on the follow through, you do this, if you work on this for 30 seconds a day, this motion right here, and then you go back, hands in, club head out, hands in, club head out. You work on that for 30 seconds a day, your back swing is gonna get better, your down swing is gonna get better, you're gonna hit more solid shots. So I'm gonna just hit a little shot just like that. So I'm gonna go ahead and set up. All I'm thinking about is hands in, club head out, hands in, club head out, doing that on both sides of the swing. And I just hit that ball about 30 yards, dead straight, nice and solid. You can see all my fundamentals that I like. Weight forward, arms straight, hands in, hands are over here, club heads out. So many golfers throwing their club way out to the right. That's off the arc. You're gonna have all kinds of inconsistencies doing that. We don't want that. We want you to be consistent. We want you to be a consistent golfer, have more fun on the course. So you need to do these practice drills at home. You have to stick with it. Videotape yourself face on like this. Here we go, again. Hands in, club head out, hands in, club head out. You can see I can hit that ground in the same spot every single time. And yes, this works for all clubs. Chipping, putting, full shots, pitch shots, sand shots. Works for everything, driver. So again, very slow. You can see my slow motion shots here. Slow motion, I know Jonathan always likes to put that in there, mix it in. Motion helps you. Slow motion gives you the weight of the club. It gives you the feel in your hands. You're taking your time. Hands in, club head out. So when you're doing these little shots, hands in, club head out. You're just chipping the ball. You're not hitting it far. You don't want to hit it far. These are little 30 yard shots. You're just working on this, taking your time. I had a lesson earlier this morning. I get out here early at Deer Creek. I love early morning lessons. So what we did was we focused on the front side of the arc, hands in, club head out. We just kept working on hands in, club head out, tracing the arc, shoulders moving in a circle, moving around. The more we did this, the more solid the shots became, the more controlled the body became. You know, in golf, if you just take one ball after another and just rake it in and hit it, you're not gonna get better. You gotta go step by step, take your time, hit small shots, hit slow motion shots, and just hit little balls out there. I mean, I really can't hit it more solid than that. You know, true, it's like that was about a 40 yard, 50 yard shot right there. In fact, it's still rolling. But I know you can't, you know, you can't go play a golf course like that. But what it does is it builds in the fundamentals. It builds in the things that are gonna lower your scores. You have to build, the building blocks. I can't say that enough. When I was a kid, I remember the pro, all he had us do when I was young, eight, nine, 10 years old at Mount Prospect, we chipped and putted 
So what were we doing? We were building in the fundamental of good contact, controlling the face. I didn't realize that until later that those couple years of doing that during the junior clinic really instilled all the wonderful fundamentals that I do right now. So here we go. So hands in, club head out on the backswing. Okay. So you can see this here as I go back, hands in, club head out. Now, when I do that, I'm not reaching. So you can see I don't, I'm not losing the connection from my arms to my body. I'm keeping my arms to my body. So hands in, club head out. You can see as I go back, you can even start to feel how your wrist work then. So hands in, club head out. My right arm starts to slightly bend. My right wrist starts to slightly bend. My club face is still closed to the shaft here. I'm not opening the club. I'm not closing the club. There's so many golfers that play and when they come to see me for lessons, they'll get into their backswing and their face will be extremely closed. And they wonder why they can't hit the ball straight because now they have to do something opposite in the downswing. So let's keep it all the same. Let's keep it all kind of tied in there that you don't have to do so many different things to hit the ball solid. I know I'll get people that will come in and they'll roll their hands and then the club face will be way open. Then they got to come over to the top. So just this little motion, slow motion backswing of learning this connection from arms to the body. The back swing, okay? Then moving forward and the down swing and the hands in, club head out and working on that shot here. I'm telling you, 30 shots in 30 seconds. You do this 30 seconds a day, this slow. Of course you're gonna do it more than 30 seconds, but you're gonna wanna do it more because you're hitting the ball so solid. Why wouldn't you? And of course, I'm always excited, 30 shots, maybe a long high goal, but at least you're gonna, you know, if you shoot for 30, maybe you'll get five or 10. How about that? That would be pretty good for your scores too. Not a bad thing, right? So again, hands in, club head out, little slow motion, working on both sides of the arc. That's gonna help your game. I'm gonna have Jonathan bring the camera around down the line so you can see from this angle as well. All right, golfers, so I had Jonathan move the camera down the line, which is going to help you get that next dimension of what we're talking about here, how to drop 30 shots in 30 seconds by fixing your backswing, which also helps you fix your downswing. So here we go. So what we're doing is we're setting up to the ball. We're getting here. So what we're doing is we're going hands in, club head out. Okay, hands in, club head out on the backswing. Hands in, club head out on the follow through. So those two motions, hands in, club head out, hands in, club head out. So that's going to give you the baseline for your takeaway. So many golfers take the club back and they turn the club face down or they lift their arms or if they pull the club too far in. So what we're doing here is we're feeling the connection of our arms to our body. We're allowing the shoulder down. We're bringing the hands in, club head out. And you can see as I get to the top now, that looks like a pretty good backswing. Now as I come down, hands in, club head out. Hands in, club head out. I'll teach a lot of golfers, they'll come to me, they'll hit the ball off the heel a lot. So what happens is their hands go way too far out. Or they're swinging, they're told to swing out to right field. And they're turning the face down. So we're tracing an arc around our body, the circle, the arc. So hands in, club head out. Hands in, club head out. Again, slow motion drills. Hit the ball 20, 30 yards. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that for you here. So slow motion, hands in, club it out, hands in, club head out. I'm not looking to hit the ball far, but you can see what happens. My weight's forward. My hands have traced the arc. My club head is on this side of my body. My hands are on this side of my body here. I'm not scooping the ball. I'm not helping the ball. I'm not trying to lift it in the air. I'm not moving the club in or over. So all these drills are gonna help you hit the ball more solid. So from there, then we go ahead and we do it a little bit further. Again, hands in, club head out. So we set here, we feel a connection from our arms to our body. Hands in, club head out. You can see how I'm moving the club back now. So you can see the slow motion. Hands in, club head out. Coming back down, moving in the arc around our body. So that looks like a pretty damn good golf swing there. Oops, shouldn't say that, but that's good. So here we go. So we're gonna do that hands in, club head out. Hands in, club head out. Hit the ball nice and solid, tracing the arc. Really solid, hit the ball first, then the turf. That's what we want. So from here, again, 
I'm gonna get a little more detail now as we go back. So set up, we have our right arm in the good position, our setup, our connection. As I go back, hands in, club it out. You can see how my wrists are working. You can see how my right arm's working, my right wrist, my left wrist. As the club goes up, it's in a good position. Then it's gonna come back down, hands in, club it out. You can see here when I get to the shaft parallel to the ground, the club head still above my hands. It's not casted. It's above my hands as I hit the back of the ball. Hitting the back of the ball, moving around. So now my hands are working in an arc. My club head's working in an arc. It's allowing you to hit the ball solid and straight. Again, I'm gonna do a small swing here. Hands in, club it out. Hands in, club it out. This little motion. Nice little shot right there. Not trying to hit it hard, not trying to hit it far. Again, just that same little motion. We're able to do this on a consistent basis. Hands in, club it out, hands in, club it out. I'll do a lot of this in my pre-shot routine. There we go. It's not exciting, but it's gonna help you hit the ball more solid. So stick with that, understanding the arc, do slow motion drills, get the feel of the hands in, club head out, fix your backswing, lower your scores. I know you're gonna play better golf and have more fun on the course. All right, golfers, thanks again for watching. Do those fundamentals, hands in, club head out, Fix your backswing, drop 30 shots in 30 seconds. I know it's gonna help you hit the ball more solid, straighter and farther, do it slow. Please subscribe to my channel. It only helps me grow, bring you more content on a weekly basis. Hit the like button, leave a comment, share it with your friends and we'll see you soon.